We are here addressing a problem which could have been solved over the last 14 to 15 years. The procedure for the imposition of the fines which have been in place since 2006 was a procedure which was wrong in law. And that procedure was by way of an order made under the Provisional Collection of Tax Act. And secondly, that that order had expired in 2007 because those orders are only of a temporary nature and had not been renewed since then. And therefore, there was no legal basis for the imposition of these higher fines. 14 years later, and this fix is now being hurriedly brought on a Friday, a date which the standing orders doesn't allow the House to sit on unless a special permission is granted seeking to pass this bill in a hurry. It's extremely unsatisfactory that the Road Traffic Act 2018, which would have repealed and replaced the old Road Traffic Act from the 1930s, and which has in it modernized levels of fines, and which the government, when passing that legislation, said would be brought into effect within three months with regulations, is still not in effect and those regulations are still not ready. Had that been done with the necessary expedition and diligence, we would not be here today dealing with this problem in this rather unorthodox way, where we're amending an act which is about to be repealed once a new act is brought into effect. I think it represents a dereliction on the part of the government in bringing the Road Traffic Act into effect. A lot of work has been done on that act. It didn't start in 2018. The legislation was brought to the House in the years leading up to that, from the, when we were in government. And for it to have not been brought into effect three years later is just deplorable. We haven't even been given an explanation as to why this is being rushed. Haste make waste, a really haphazard, chaka chaka way of dealing with the matter.